Welcome to today's edition of Public Health Minute with Bill Latimer. Florida has over 1 million swimming pools and nearly 8,500 miles of tidal shoreline. It has also experienced some of the highest rates of child drowning deaths in recent years. Sean DeRosa, Director of Aquatics at Penn State University, studies aquatic safety. Sean, how can we best prevent drowning deaths? Accidental drowning is a preventable tragedy. To help prevent drowning, use multiple barriers to prevent children from getting near a backyard pool. Always stay within arm's reach of a young child. Never leave a child alone, even for a few seconds. All non-swimmers should wear a properly fitted life jacket. Enroll all children in swimming lessons and continue through all levels. Learn CPR. It helps save lives. Lastly, swim near a lifeguard and remember that no one can watch a child as closely as their own parent. Public Health Minute is co-sponsored by the Lehman College School of Health Sciences, Human Services and Nursing at the City University of New York and the University of Florida College of Public Health and Health Professions. I'm Bill Latimer.